hello students today let us understand how to calculate current assets current liabilities and liquid assets by using current ratio and working capital information so here we have a problem that is a firm has a current ratio of 3 to 1 here 3 is representing current assets and 1 is representing current liabilities its net working capital is 2 lakh rupees you are required to determine current assets current liabilities and liquid assets assuming inventory of rupees 2 lakh 20 thousand this problem is very much important for 6 marks so uh, if you want to solve up this problem first we need to start with let let us assume current liabilities is equal to x because since we have one year let it be x so if current liability is one then current lab current assets will be three times of current liability so it will be 3x so the working capital will be the difference between current assets and current liabilities so they have given working capital information and they have not given what's the value of current asset what's the value of current liability so we need to find out the value of current asset and current liabilities by using the given information so current or well, net working capital is 2 lakh given in the problem 2 lakh rupees is equal to current asset value we don't know but we know that current asset is three times of current liabilities so, so let us write 3x minus current liability is x x is representing current liability so here we have a value of 1 so 2 lakh is equal to 3x minus x it will be 2x therefore x is equal to 2 lakh divided by 2 x is equal to 1 lakh rupees therefore current liability is equal to 1 lakh rupees therefore liabilities is equal to rupees 1 lakh if current liability is equal to 1 lakh rupees then current assets will be 3 times of current liability therefore current assets is equal to 1 lakh into 3 isn't it 3 lakh 3 into x we know the value of x that is 1 lakh 1 lakh into 3 you will get 3 lakh rupees this is current asset so you can cross verify by using these two amounts with the given current ratio current ratio they have given 3 is to 1 so 3 lakh is to 1 lakh is equal to 3 is to 1 therefore our answer is correct so next we need to find out liquid asset assuming inventory of rupees 2 lakh 20 thousand so if you did the stock value from the current asset value remaining value will be the current asset so sorry liquid assets liquid assets is equal to current assets minus inventory as per this problem so we need to exclude inventory then prepaid expenses and bad debt balance from the current assets to find out liquid assets but in this problem they have given only inventory value so if we exclude inventory value from the current asset we will get liquid assets value current asset is equal to 3 lakh we have calculated already minus inventory value they have given 2 lakh 20 thousand so we need to deduct that 2 lakh 20 thousand remaining 80 thousand will be liquid assets so if you calculate this much we are going to get 6 marks thank you